We didn't lie when we told mom and dad we were by the water, only that had they been there, they wouldn't have seen us. Maybe they would be able to hear our secrets, our dreams, our promises. I wonder if they could feel the love from that far away. Would they be happy too? There's a hole in the fence. On the other side, there are docks reaching out to the land across the river, like desperate hands who have spent their lives waiting. This, this is where, is where we, are. we are. The first time we went, you would notice it first. We are lost to ourselves and the world around us. So we sit until we can feel our hearts beating in our ears and feel so guilty. Every time after that, we go further, asking now to be lost. There is something we are trying to find. They don't know how this freedom is addicting. Dad told me how he doesn't know why the sidewalk ends there or why it hasn't been fixed. The history is lost, so we make one out. The city is in front of us, sprawled out like it's begging to be painted. Our goal was to love, and we did, but we weren't satisfied. Breathing in the sound of the river, soaking up and spitting out memories. This place collects love. Last summer we came here when I wanted you to kiss me. I couldn't figure out how to say it. I remember in the beginning when she met the two of you. Our worlds bleed into each other and onto the seams of the concrete. I think about us. How we started here. How our lives began writing themselves into each other. I think about us and our promise. Promise me. I promise. I remember how we went here that night that everything fell apart before we had seen anything coming. When it was just us and the city and her and him. We talked about what it would be like to fly and how the movies changed our lives. I remember how you held me and how the skyline held us both. We were the gods the people prayed to. Unseen, we were everything. Tonight the river looks like liquid sky, reflecting the pink and dirty gray, the yellow lights from other lives. I hope it swallows us up. Maybe one day we will be the liquid birds and our families will turn us into fables, moral legends, and mortal stories. No one will know and everyone will have heard about the kids that ruled the liquid city. I wonder if it will be a story about love. At least that's what it was to us.